Voices that I'm looking for on series two are voices that will be able to make a great album, relate to people and just give you goosebumps. I'm going to be looking for a wide variety of singers like I did last time, just try and spread out the talent amongst the whole team. You know, the blind auditions really differentiate this talent show from the others. It's not about making fun of people, it's about being hypnotized without seeing a visual the way music ought to be. Ooh, have I thought of new ways to press the button? Yes. I can use my head, my elbow, my feet, my bum. The only one thing I haven't used yet is my bum, so I'm going to try and, uh, I'm going to try and use that. Maybe my shoulder, like a little shoulder. If there's an up-tempo number that I'm kind of liking, that could be a new one thrown in there. Yes, I'm going to keep standing on my chair. I'm going to keep standing on these as well, so... There you go, get used to it, baby. Get used to it. Hello, Keith. My favourite moment from 2012 was having the opportunity to perform with Queen at the Olympics. It was crazy cool. My favourite moment of 2012 was winning The Voice. I had a couple of them. Running with the torch, singing on The Voice with Tyler, doing the Queen's Jubilee, campaign for Obama, and then he won and we're backstage like, yeah, we did it. And This Is Love, how big, it, how big This Is Love was. Probably when Hall of Fame, um, the song that we did with Will I Am went number one. You know, it was definitely because of the voice um, that we kind of linked up and, and did the song, so that was a big moment for me. There's, there hasn't been a dull moment.